Hey guys, it's me Melissa and welcome back to my channel. Today we got some more of the Poshmark mystery clothing boxes. Now these two boxes are actually from the same girl that I bought them from last time. I went on her, her closet on Poshmark and I saw she had, she didn't have any mediums available. So I kind of wrote on one of the small ones and I was like, hey, how many come in this bundle? And she's like 13. And I was like, well, by any chance, could you make a medium one? She's like, yeah, I can totally make a medium one. I was like, same price, same amount of items? And she's like, yeah. I was like, could you make two? And she's like, yeah. So what she did was she literally just made a little, like a new post. I bought them right off the new post that just got put up. And here they are. So if you want to check her out and you maybe don't see the size of something you want, maybe just comment on one of her bundles and be like, hey, do you have extra large? Do you have large? Do you have this? And maybe she'll be able to make you your own box. So I got these for $10 with a $7.95 shipping because everything on Poshmark has $7.95 shipping. Um, so, I mean, $10, if there's 13 items in each of these and I even get a smidgen amount of stuff that I could use, I mean, that's pretty awesome. And I kind of enjoying this whole mystery clothing type thing. It's different. It's, it's a different kind of clothing haul. And you guys know I love a mystery. So I'm excited. I'm excited. Uh, I'll link her down, her closet down below. She doesn't know I'm a YouTuber. I didn't tell her anything about that. So these were not like made special for me or anything. I don't even use my, I use my like regular email when I, when I buy in other places. All right. Well, let's see. Open it up. Little green tissue paper. As you know, I'm going to probably become a hot mess trying on all these clothes. Cause I thought about it after I bought the first one, I was like, if there's 13 in each, that's a lot of outfit changes. <laughs> that's a lot of outfit changes. But let's see what we got. So I guess we'll kind of go like half and half and then we'll try on half and try on. All right, here's the first one I got. I'm gonna check and make sure there are mediums. Medium, it says, mind over matter. Mind over matter. <laughs> mind over matter. And then it says, if it ain't mind, mind, then don't matter. Mind denim. I've never heard of mind denim. Have you heard of mind denim? I mean, it seems like a nice shirt. I don't have many shirts that I like stuck on the back of it. Where it comes worse, it'll be a night shirt. Maybe I'll pull them all out and then we'll try them on. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> Here's another shirt. I'm guessing what she does is she probably goes to thrift stores, gets a whole bunch of stuff for insanely cheap, kind of like maybe my store where you can get things like 90% off, and then just sells them in bundles. This one says, I am exclusive. <laughs> Looks like it might be a little bit of a crop toppy, maybe. I am exclusive. And this one... Does say medium too. So we got two shirts so far. What's next? Another shirt. This says, so you're mad? <laughs> and the back is team swag, swag, swaggly cons? Look, fish. I don't know what that is. <laughs> so this is the, the front of it. This would be a good night shirt. <laughs> and that is the back. I may have to look that up. So three shirts so far. Here we got another shirt. And this, it's all stuck together, but it's like a flowier, longer type tank. We're going to work with whatever bra I have on today. Next we have a dress. That's cute. It might be short. might be short, but it is cute. Just think, all this stuff, all this stuff right here, $10 plus the shipping. What's next? Well, this is a different shirt. <laughs> Look at that. It is kind of like fraying out at the bottom. I guess if you wanted to, you could just cut off the ones that are fraying. Oh, well, it's just in the back. Well, it was a big bundle right here. Look at that. Big bundle. All stuck together. I mean, working with worse, you could always just cut off all the strings and just have it be like it is in the front. Crop topping. And then we got a skirt. Look at that. That's different, huh? Kind of like, does it remind you kind of like 80s like? Got a zipper in the back by Candies. I know what that is. Elastic on the top, size medium. Let's just pull them all out, then we'll try them on kind of like in a system. Next we have this, Pretty Rebellious. Did I tell you any of the names of anything? <laughs> I don't think I did. This is Diamond Supply Company. This is Zara Treplique. I'm, I'm off my game. This is just, this one is just two licks. This one is energy. 
The dress is Miss Daisy. Miss Daisy. Off my game, guys. This shirt is Empire. And the skirt I just told you was a candies. This shirt is pretty rebellious. And it's just like kind of like a workout shirt. Definitely be able to see through it, but it is what it is. It's gonna be a lot of trying on. Then is this a shirt? Shirt? Shirt. Little kind of crochet type shirt. You can wear a tank top underneath it. This is by Rap City. Made in Mexico. That's different. Guess I'll try that on over something. Or maybe without anything on? We'll see. I think it might be all shirts beside that one dress and that one. Oh, and a skirt, I guess. This is a skirt. That is going to be short. <laughs> I guess it could be a bathing suit cover up too. This is by Star City. That can be short. Did it shave my legs? Probably not. Next shirt is by Sweet Wander. Oh, this is another one. I know the name of it now. This is a cold shoulder shirt. I'm learning, guys. Cold shoulder shirt. That one's kind of cute, so might as well try that on. We got two more items in this box. This does not... I guess it does. This is by Demeanor. Demeanor. That's cute. I'm mean, kind of into like the flowy tank style, if I can get them. And the last thing in the box is this is like a regular old shirt by Gildan. And it says Crunch Donut Factory. www.crunchdonut.com. Home of the Superstar Donuts, Las Vegas. Okay, I went on a trip and I didn't even go. <laughs> Alright, so let's try on the shirts, then the skirts, then the dress. Okay, guys, so here's shirt number one. So I'm wearing black pants, <laughs> but it goes to about here. I mean, it's a good fit. I can't see myself wearing this out because I don't really even know what the brand is, but I can see myself wearing it to sleep. The only downfall is you really can feel it on here. Like, it reminds me a little bit of, like, Wish shirts. Like, I don't know how many times it's been washed, but I can feel it. I can feel it almost through the shirt at me, so I don't know if I'll keep this one. But that is shirt number one. Next one. Here's the second one. Like I said, it is kind of a crop top. It's fine. Sometimes I wear shirts like this to sleep and I'll wear a tank top underneath it just so I don't feel like weird, but I'm exclusive. So I'm definitely gonna keep this one because it's funny. But yeah, just a regular black shirt. The sleeves are a little bit tight, but you can just pull them out a little bit and they'll just like start to loosen up a little bit. My guns. <laughs> All right. I'm probably not going to be going in the order that I showed them to you because I just literally push them up in a ball and, you know, it is what it is. So, on to the next one. And here's this one. It goes down to about here. So, it's definitely an oversized kind of, like, almost like a man's cut shirt medium. But it does have a V-cut right here, a V-neck. This, I'm probably, I'm definitely going to keep this for a night nice shirt. Because it's funny, I like, you know, so you're mad? You mad? <laughs> I'm not sure about this thing in the back. I'm going to have to look that up and see exactly what it's for. I'm, keep in mind, I'm 41. I'm up on all the trends. And I'm happy with that. I'm fine with that. <laughs> Alright, on to the next. And here's this one. This is definitely crappy. <laughs> and all that, like, jumbleness in the back. I kind of almost wish this part was everywhere. Like, if this part was everywhere, there's a chance that I would wear this out. But just the fact that it's, like, these would have to be cut off. And not that I don't think that, I, not that I think that I'm fat or anything. I know you guys are like, you have a perfect body. It doesn't all feel comfortable at 41 walking around with my stomach out. <laughs> Just don't feel comfortable. So this one's probably going to be a dud for me, mainly because, you know, it's crop and this is a little kind of crazy town. And if I try to cut it all off, I'll probably mess it up somehow. All right, what's next? And here is this one. I mean, it's actually kind of cute. I thought you'd be able to see my bra, but you really can't see my bra. But you can, like, see my pants, like, through the dress thing. You just need to see my raw in the back a little bit more. And you, like, see my tattoo, which is my test and everything. But it is very light. And that's really, really good in Florida. I don't have a lot of things. I'm really big on symmetry. I know some of you are, too, and some of you don't care. So I don't know if this will bother me that it's not all the same length. Like, I wish it was all the same length. But there's a chance I may wear it. I may even bring it 
So I'm filming this before Rhode Island, but my goal was I was like, I want to quickly film this right before I go to Rhode Island, just in case there's any gems in here that I can bring with me. This is actually something I might even think about. Okay, on to the next one. All right, this is kind of cute too. Obviously I'm gonna be wearing this bra, but since it's Razorback, I have like Razorback bras that I might be able to wear with it. Or even like just a bando top or a stick-on bra or something. But I like it, it's kind of like fun at the bottom. It's like see-through, but it's not like you're showing everything. And you see my bra is like, <laughs> I buy these bras, I bought this at Walmart, and it's like extra so you don't have that like <laughs> armpit fat or whatever you want to call it. <laughs> In shirts. Yeah, I think I'm going to keep this one too. Alright, on to the next shirt. And here this one is. And even though, yes, it's a style that I'm not used to. I'm not used to this cold shoulder situation, but it is very cute. And this is actually kind of like fancy. It makes me feel like a little bit more dressed up. Where you can wear like a pair of jeans and put this on and feel a little bit more dressed up. Obviously it needs to be like ironed. <laughs> but that's okay. I mean, it's different. Now how high does it go when I lift my arm up? I mean, but how, how often do you lift your arm up like that? Not often. And it's kind of neat. It's almost like a little bit sexy because you get a little shoulder ash in. <laughs> I don't know. I'm a weirdo. Okay. On to the next shirt. And here's this one. Just a basic little tank top. Does it see through? A little bit. But it's racer back and I have racer back bras so I can wear with this. I actually like this too. <laughs> like, I've been liking the kind of like relaxed fit shirts. Okay. This box isn't that bad, guys. We're doing pretty good. I think I only have two things on the floor that I'm for sure not keeping. So that's pretty good. All right, on to the next shirt. And here this one is. Now this is probably not something that I would keep because I have plenty of night shirts. But I think since my cousin, um, Allison, is obsessed with donuts and I'm going up to Rhode Island, I'm going to wash this. I'm going to bring it to her. If she wants it, she can have it. If she's never heard of this, like she might have heard of this uh, donut place. And maybe it's like an honor to-do list to go to or something. So I'll wash it and then I'll give it to her and see if she wants it. I think we have one more shirt, then we're on to the skirts. And here's this one. Yeah, you definitely want to wear a shirt underneath it. Or I'm pretty sure if I wore a black bra right now, I'm pretty sure it would kind of look like it went with it. But I'm not changing my bra 19 times. It is a little bit shorter, but not ridiculous. I can see myself wearing this like in, in videos and stuff too. Kind of something a little bit different. Okay. I'm not hating this box. I'm like legit not hating this box at all. All right, I think now we're on to the skirts, and I'll just leave this shirt on, and then we'll try on the skirts. Okay, guys, so here is the first skirt. I mean, it fits pretty good. It's not too tight. You can actually, like, move your legs in it a little bit. I don't wear many skirts, but I almost feel like I should start. I mean, this is, like, really, really cute. You pack, match this with, like, a cute shirt, maybe with a little bit of, like, gold detail or something. I don't know. I should wear more skirts. I think I'm gonna keep this too. I'm gonna keep everything. I'm gonna have no room in my closet. <laughs> All right, next skirt. So here's this one. Definitely way too short <laughs> for me to wear pretty much in general, but it has the material almost like a swimsuit. And maybe because like, I'm going to Rhode Island and I'm bringing a one piece, because I'm, I'm, I'm in living that one piece life now, and I was gonna bring a whole cover up, but maybe I could just bring this kind of to wear walking around Instead of having a whole cover-up and all that stuff, I might do that. Not doing bad, guys. But, like, if I bent over, no. <laughs> but if you're bathing, it's fine. All right, now for the final thing, it would be the dress. All right, guys, so here is the dress. Now, if I was younger, maybe, but... And even though it does almost pass, like, it does, like, gets to the pe pass the test, I can't bend over at all in it. <laughs> and I like to say that I'm ladylike, because a lot of times you just go reach for something... And you don't want to show your whole business. Plus, we all know that I don't like love like the elastic-y type things around here because I feel like it gets so tight and it gives me anxiety. But it's cute. I mean, it's a very breathable kind of type material. Cute little like accents right here. There's nothing wrong with it. It's just just a little bit too short for me. So now I guess we're going to see what's uh, in the next box. I left the dress on just because it's easier. <laughs> so... With this and then the two things I have down there, so there's like three things out of the box that I'm going to say was like a hard no. And then one that is going to be going to Rhode Island, whether she keeps it or not. But otherwise, I'm going to put I'm gonna put the other ones like to the test. Like I'm going to try to wear them and see what I think about them. I also forgot to say, at the bottom, there's also three incense sticks. A little added bonus. So now, time for the next box. 
I need to like move all these clothes over. So I know what I tried on and what I didn't try on. Now, whether I'll do more of these soon, I don't think so. Like, you know, there's lots of other things I want to do. But the fact that she doesn't know who I am means that there's a possibility if she keeps doing them that I can do these later on. I'm going to have to do a whole other closet clean out. I just need a walk-in closet more than life can be told. Alright, so here's this right here. And it has a thank you thing up for supporting my small business. You're welcome. That's what it is. Shopping on Etsy, shopping on uh, Poshmark. It is helping people small business. Look, she threw in... A real peach essence mask. Real peach essence mask. I'm not big on the face mask, but I'll probably just keep these and put them into like one of my mystery type bags that I sell. So, all right. What's first? Give me a break. <laughs> this has got a tag on it still. Style. Is there a price on it? No. Exclusive for five below. This is probably five bucks. Because almost all the clothing things are five bucks. How am I going to try this on? I like that it has padding in it. It'd be nice just to wear, like, casually wear. I wear a shirt that maybe you can't see through. Does it say medium? Medium? It's very soft and brand new. Brand new. Give me a break. I'm rather Kit Kat. <laughs> so we got that. And then we got another. This is a dress. This is Black Bead USA. I'm thinking this is a dress. Yeah, it's got to be because, like, it tapers in there. Oh, that's gonna be a sexy one. That's gonna be a se that's gonna be tight. <laughs> that's gonna be tight. Is it a medium? Doesn't even say. That's gonna be tight. <laughs> that's gonna be one of them bootylicious uh, dresses. All right, what's next? This another dress? Yes. So this is another dress. This is like a t-shirt dress. What is on it? Oh, but it has like paint on it, like all over it. I'll try it on, but obviously we know that this one's not passing the cut. <laughs> not wearing any stain stuff. What's next? Next we have... Isn't this a skirt? This is different. <laughs> this one's different. I'm gonna, it's probably going to take me a minute to figure out like how to get it on. <laughs> and that is Charlotte Ruth. You know me, when things are really weird and un-like whatever, I'm just like, I can't do it. <laughs> What's next? We got another cute little definitely gonna be a crop top shirt. What's that geometric? Who's this by? Rue 21. I know a lot of times I still dress like I'm in my 20s and teens. You know what? Might as well do it for as long as I can. <laughs> That's what I think of it. At some point I'm gonna have to like, I don't know, wear a blouse <laughs> or something. But I'm not going until I have to. All right, what's next? This is from Basic H&M. H&M is expensive. And this is pretty much a little... Oh, is that a stain too? Oh, we got a little bleach stain. I mean, I guess if you're that person, you could literally just dye it. I seem to suck a lot when I dye things. I mean, I take a chance. I mean, if I dye this, if it fits good, then I might dye it black. He has a couple bleach stains. But we'll try it on. So if it fits... If it's good, maybe I'll, I'll DIY my way to something dyed. We'll see. Don't, I'm not making any promises. Alright, what is next? I mean, so far the first box, I didn't see anything wrong with any of this stuff. And this box already had two things with something wrong in it. What is this? A shirt? This is a shirt. Is that supposed to be there? This is American Eagle. Now I'm confused. Is that supposed to be there? <laughs> it's definitely textured. I don't think it's supposed to be there. Maybe somebody like painted it? Yeah, I don't think it's supposed to be there. Hmm. This box is not going as well. The last one was definitely worth the $10. We'll see if this one's worth the $10. We already have now three messed up shirts. Uh, this one right here is... I... Palik... Oh, I'm not going to say it. <laughs> not even going to say it. This is the regular old tank top. What does it say on it? Capri. Italia. 
Can't see myself wearing that around. Bed, maybe. <coughs> now this is Forever 21. I don't know anything about that. <laughs> it's got little beading all in here. I don't know about that. <laughs> I don't know about this color green on me either, but we'll try it on. <laughs> this box is not exciting. Maybe I should only bought one, but maybe if I bought one, it would have been this one. <laughs> All right, moving on. Sorry if my eyes are watery. Something like legit just fell in my eye. <laughs> I don't know what it was. And now my eyes are like all watering. <laughs> so this is by hashtag TTPIT. I'm guessing that's a dress. That's weird. Look at that material, it's like a, like a jersey. And like sparkly. I'm not loving this box. <laughs> What's next? Now we have this, this looks like it's definitely a dress. It's gonna be high, low, low dress. And this is by Just Love. Just Love. It is missing whatever cord or belt or something goes with it. Now, my October cruise, I see this is coming out after I get back from Rhode Island, so maybe about three weeks ago from now, it got canceled, my October one. I requested the money back, and I was like, you know what, I told you, I told Rob, I said, you know, they've had my money for a year and a half, they keep canceling them, I know cruises are going, but they're not going out of Jacksonville, but then the other day, they were doing this crazy deal. So I booked a new cruise for January 15th. I'm crossing the fingers on that one, but we have never gone on a cruise in that cold. We went once on February 29th. It was pretty cold that day. So it's my first time going on a cold, cold one. So it might be nice to have longer type dresses, though I feel this top is huge. I feel like that person was very busty. And then we got two more items in here. Next we have this. It is... Something, obviously somebody cut this. It's by Black Bead. But I believe somebody cut this. Do you think it came like that? Maybe it came like that. It's just like a big, like, I think it's a biker type shirt. That's gonna, that's gonna be, that's gonna be low. <laughs> that's gonna be low. We'll try that on the shirts. And one more item. Let's see. This is... Essentials by Full Tilt. Full Tilt. This is just a regular shirt. So let's try on the shirts first. And then, do we get any skirts? No. We'll do shirts first and then we'll do all the dresses. We're just gonna do a quick one with this one. But I'm not gonna lie. It's very comfy. Like this is a, a very, very comfy, soft bra, bralette. I don't know if you call these things, but it's very, very soft and very, very comfortable. So I'm definitely, this is a keeper and I love the fact that it's brand new, but we're going to move on to the next one. I for sure am not trying these on an order in any way, shape, or form. Here's this. I mean, it's just a basic shirt. You kind of have to wear your bra a little off shoulder. I wonder if it's supposed to be like this. I would never do this, but maybe you could do this. <laughs> That's not my thing. But, I mean, it's not awful. It doesn't have any stains on it. That's a bonus. Let me keep this one. Wash it all and see how it goes. All right, on to the next shirt. And here's this one. Yet again, I'm not a crop top girl, but this person doesn't know who I am. Only reason I may think I keep this is I may just wear it in a video. Because if I sit down in a video, and it's, it's at least it's something like fun to wear, but you guys won't see my midsection. So I think I will keep it for that reason. I can start wearing crop tops and you guys will never know. All right, next one. And here's this one. I mean, it's a regular tank top, but because I've like never been there and don't really care about all of that, and it's that thicker cotton, if you know what I'm saying. So I'm probably not gonna keep this one. I mean, it is what it is, it's a tank top. If you need an extra, if you didn't have this on it, I probably would keep it, but I'm just like, eh, I don't really need it. All right, on to the next. All right, so here's the one with the bleach stains. Let's not joke around. Am I really gonna spend money on a shirt that was so cheap, but I can go to the thrift store and buy another black shirt, probably for 
less than a dollar and spend probably more money buying the dye that could turn out wrong and take us a lot of time? Yeah, probably not. <laughs> so here it is. Like I said, this one had the bleach on it. It's going to go into the... Ah, should I even put it in the dojo pile? With stains in it? I guess I can to get it sort through it. Like I said, somebody else wanna, might want to get it and DIY it. All right, on to the next one. Here's this one. I mean, I'm not a huge fan of stripes and this kind of stripes. And I really legitimately think that this is not supposed to be here. It could be. I could be completely wrong. Like, this may be how it is done. Like, that's the pattern of it. But to me, it looks like this may have made a mess or attempted to do something and it didn't work out. But I could be totally wrong. It does have these. It's so hot up here right now. <laughs> I picked the wrong day to be trying on clothes. And it does have a hood. But this is going to be a no for me also. Can we have one more shirt? Yep, one more shirt. And I did find a skirt. So we have one more shirt, skirt, and then three dresses. Here's this one. <laughs> totally not me. I mean, if you're wearing a bathing suit top underneath it and you're like going around or whatever, but it's kind of thick. It almost seems like it could be like a cover-up. It almost has that material where it could be like a towel-esque. There's really not much more to say about this. <laughs> Alright, let's try the... I'm going to put my other shirt on I was wearing earlier. And then we'll try on the other stuff. The skirt. Alright guys, your personal preference. But I don't like this. <laughs> this like takes my phobia of non-symmetry to like the final the final <laughs> for it to be so short over here and then like so ridiculously long on this side like that's ridiculously long i can't do it i can't do it this might be sexy on somebody and they'd be like oh my god that's the best skirt ever no i feel like a weirdo and you know not no no hurt on the person that sent it on erica who sent it but like it's not me <laughs> all right dress time all right, so here it is Stainy. The one with all the stains on it. I'm pretty sure, like, I can see it doing weird in the camera, so I'm pretty sure it's doing weird for you two in the camera. Obviously, I'm not keeping this. I'm not even vaguely. I have to, like, stress this out. Like, I, I just don't feel comfortable with these, like, stuck to my stomach. It's comfortable. But it's got stains on it. And I can't see myself wearing this out of the house. Those are all these stripes. All right, next dress. Here this one is. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. <laughs> There's way too many different kinds of material on this. I didn't zip it up all the way, but it's got like this weird like jersey material. This is like a suede type. Then we got this, you know, see-through like, I don't know you call it, like satin on there. And it's too short if I bend over. I don't like this at all. Like who bought this and was like, this is, this is fashionable. This is trendy. I want like a, uh, I want to want dress kind of like a jersey in the middle, like sports time in the middle, but then like fancy everywhere else. Next dress. Alright guys, I forgot to show you this shirt. This is it. I'm panned up. <laughs> I don't like this at all. This is not going to be a shirt for me. So let's just get this out of the way. I was trying to dress this so I don't have pants on. <laughs> That's why I don't see it all. But, um, yeah. It's not for me. Polka dots, the color. This is itchy. Not for me. Alright, now back onto the dresses. Now here's this one. And I was incorrect about it being high-low in the front and back is high low on the side not my favorite <laughs> plus this top is huge like there's no way this will stay up on me like a little tug gone <laughs> it isn't tight here but this thing will kill me the whole this side being down will kill me this box is not so great we have one more thing and then we're finishing this box all right let's try it on all right guys so here's this one i mean it's a pretty sexy dress that I don't feel like this top's going to come down at all. I may have to firm up a little bit right around here. But it is cute. Could be something I wear on a cruise because it's a little bit longer. I had the thing pulled up a little bit. But it's kind of like a sweater, so it's a little bit thicker. Which I'm dying up here. <laughs> but, yeah, so this is pretty cute. This will be a keeper. That was a lot. That's like four for the keeper out of the whole thing. Alright, let's finish this video. All right, guys, I took my bra straps down so it would look less, I don't know, weird <laughs> me sitting here. Um, but this dress is even actually comfortable, even just to sit, like, Indian style on the on the bed with. Final results. First box, 
Not bad at all. Definitely worth the $10. Second box. I'm literally only keeping four items. And I can definitely get more than four items at my thrift store when they're doing the 75% off, 90 and all that stuff. So I'm saying the, next one, the second one wasn't. Good thing we opened that one first. It would have been better if we opened that one first. Hmm. It's a gamble. As you know, with any mystery box, clothing, miscellaneous stuff, anything, it's always going to be a gamble. So you never know what you're going to get. Maybe she only had like enough good stuff to make one box and then she was just kind of scrambling to make the second box since she didn't even have a medium one up for sale. So, I mean, it's up to you if you want to try something like this out. I'll put her link, like I said, down in the description box. If you want to check her out, if you want something that she doesn't have, message her. See if she has that. She can make you one. Tell her you don't want anything with stains. <laughs> Alright, I'm burning up, so <laughs> if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments or any questions, please put them down below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you had not yet subscribed, I did a lot of changes today. Look it. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. I'll see you soon. Bye!